Uh, excuse me. So, you guys need to see something. This is going to be backwards, but you'll get the idea. How unbelievably awesome is that? See the little so local thing right there? That is really good. So yeah. Guy by the name of Dave Myers. Watched the podcast yesterday. And uh, just uh, made it. What? Um... <laughs> I'm still kind of in shock at how, un like, he just frick completely and totally nailed what was in our head. To wall. It's pretty good. Um. Oh, okay. All right. Hey, Brianna, how are you doing? So we'll get some uh, comments on here. Oh, excuse me. Oh. Hey, Dave Myers, what's going on, man? I was just showing off your work. Hopefully you saw that. Dave Myers is actually in here right now. If you would like to uh, applaud or generally uh, bow down to his greatness, um, yeah, that will be entirely acceptable. All right. We're not getting any comments on there at all. It's very sad. So, I'm going to bring it in. Yes, Brianna, I have all of the shirts. Yeah, Katie, we, we'll do another run of uh, uh, shirts and everything probably in the next couple weeks. I think we'll probably have some coffee on the dock t-shirts now. Um, Dave, I'm going to need to know what size you are because uh, I'm sending you one. Uh, yeah, these hoodies are, are they're actually really, really nice, like warm and fuzzy and good goodness. Yep, good stuff. Um, real quick, um, we're doing a uh, Goals and Gratitude meetup tomorrow. So for anyone who was at the event or for anyone who missed the event, um, 6.30 at Gildog, we're going to be running through uh, just a real quick version of what I do every morning anyway. Um, and then we'll be uh, um, um, doing some one-on-one uh, -on -one, uh, um, sort of game plan type stuff. So yeah, so yeah. That'll be fun. And then right after that is the, uh, hey, Heather, got all your shirts and stuff. Oh, and so that's the other thing, too. I'm going to have everybody's shirts are going to be at uh, Guild Dog tomorrow as well. Um, and I'll be taking orders for the next run. Um, I'm gonna, I need to talk to Jimmy about it, but I'm pretty sure there's going to be uh, all the Bad Boy Room t-shirts and, and hoodies that we've been doing, as well as Goals and Gratitude t-shirts and Coffee on the Dock t-shirts. And maybe Coffee on the Dock mugs. mugs. Um, and I'm hoping that by Christmas, I'm going to be able to start a Coffee on the Dock coffee brand, um, which would be <laughs> really funny. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, that's good stuff right there. Mm. So, um... I am uh, not huge on the uh, details, but uh, actually, Greg just sent me some stuff here. Um, right, coffee. Well, John, can you imagine drinking coffee on the dock? Coffee. I'm gonna I'm gonna get some free trade uh, uh, and like organic coffee, um, and just have it. You know, I'm gonna pick the mix and do all that stuff, and it's gonna be uh, uh, coffee on the dock coffee. What? Anyways. Um, right? 
It just makes sense. Got to have a mug. So yeah, we'll do that. Um, I think Jimmy. I think Jimmy can do those things. If not, he'll be able to figure it out. The man's a genius. It's just ridiculous. Uh, so Hudson Elementary uh, is doing a, what's called a grant uh, on Friday, and they need volunteers. And I believe that these volunteers are just going to be going in and reading to uh, reading to classes. Um, and if you're interested in that, you can uh, contact Greg. He knows the people that's going on. But you can also contact Lisa Gaines. This is her email address, l-g-a-n-e-s at pasco.k12.fl.us. Uh, so you can interest her if you're interested in going down on Friday to do uh, part of the American uh, Great American Teaching. Hello, Dino. <laughs> Dave Myers says, I'll have to watch this later. I have a handful of folks in my office who won't shut up. So it, seriously, applaud that man. He's the guy who came up with the uh, the logo, and it's it's brilliant. Um, Brianna says, my friends run Tampa Bay Coffee Club. How cool would it be if one of their packages features your coffee? Yeah, that'd be great. That'd be really great. Um, Brianna, let, could you private message me that, please, so that I don't forget about it? That's where my love bug goes. Could you tell me what that means? He goes to Tampa Bay Coffee Club? Is that, is that a thing? I feel like that... Eh, whatever. Whatever. Let's go here. Uh, Jesus, I sorry I missed this weekend. Back is all jacked up. I hear you, brother. Yeah, so Gills, 6.30, like tomorrow. Um, Heather, if you want to come by Gills, you can pick up your t-shirts as well. I'm going to have them all at Gill Dog tomorrow. And we're going to be doing uh, like a goals and gratitude thing and the drum circle, that kind of thing. Oh, cool. Hudson Elementary is where she goes to school. Well, that makes way more sense. Yeah, Bruce is mail order coffee. Uh, it's, oh, at nighttime. Nighttime. Because it's we're going to do a little goals and gratitude session right before the drum circle that Laura puts on every other Wednesday. So that'll be Gill Dog, 6.30 p.m., tomorrow um we're also going to be doing some uh, some goal setting and some uh, some gratitude work and just basically what we do in the morning we're just going to do it over gildog in person um also hashtag sharing is caring um if you uh even if you could think of one person that you would like to have in here to you know uh bring up some, some cool stuff or whatever you can invite just one person or you can share the whole thing that'd be awesome i just noticed that uh, zoe shared it Thank you, Zoe. You are the best. Hashtag sharing is caring. Um, so some of you guys might not have seen it. I'm going to show it to you guys again because it is redonkulous. So this, or a version very much like it, is, can you see that? Is it gonna be on t-shirts, and coffee mugs, probably some coffee stuff. You can go away now, I don't know what you're doing. Like seriously, a monkey wearing a moose hat, drinking out of a solo local Pasco coffee mug, riding an EM drive in space. I mean, come on! It's so good. That's okay, Angela, we'll do it again. That's yeah, perfect, eh, Zoe? You got to like it. You got to like it. Mm. Right? I'm excited. So, yeah, we're going to have... Uh, um, a bunch of stuff for the Christmas holiday situaciones. Sorry, this coffee is really good. Do you know I didn't have time to uh, to look at that yesterday, except briefly. I'm definitely going to be talking to them for sure. I'd love to go and sit down with them, um, but especially now that uh, now that we have uh, um, the 
the almost complete, apparently, uh, logo situation. I, I don't imagine that we uh, will have a problem figuring that out. How would you guys feel? Uh, I mean, like just doing a single bag of coffee and stuff, like the, the, the back end for all the merch stuff is starting to get super complicated. I kind of think... And I wanted to ask you guys about this. Like, would you do a subscription service? Like, I don't know how much the coffee is going to be, um, but I'd rather do it so that, like, if you're going to do it instead of just doing it one time, you know, it's like a, it's like a thing, you know, um, the coffee will keep coming. It's going to come to me. So we need to like, that's where we need to meet up at, uh, you know, the, the goals graduate event or whatever. I imagine I could do, uh, uh, um, drop shipping from me to people that'll cost more. And honestly, I'll probably jack the price up on it because the, uh, just the time involved, the, it will destroy me. <laughs> um, but yeah, what I'm thinking is we do we do like a, a subscription service. Your coffee will come every month from Coffee on the Dock. It's gonna be free trade, organic. Um, and then you know if you're picking up a T-shirt or meeting me at a show or doing the the goals and gratitude thing, or worst case scenario, I can just like run around if you're close and, and uh, drop it off. I don't know. What the, f- Jillian? You need decaf? That's not a thing. You might be screwed. However, we will have coffee on the dock mugs. Hey, Daryl, let's do my own coffee and cannabis. Awesome. Will the cups be up and running before Christmas? Angela, I, I am, that's my goal. Um, and I believe that it's possible. I don't know what the, uh, the, 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 the tail is on that, but now that we've got the logo now, I think that we have enough time. So I'll, I'm going to talk to Jimmy about that today. Because, yeah, I mean, there, it's going to be, what? It's going to be cool. Muy cool, muy cool. All right, Dino, awesome. Thanks, thanks, man. He's just saying there's more pages like that, which is really good. Um, I'll start it now. Anybody who wants to uh, start putting some more orders in for uh, for shirts, just uh, private message me with uh, with what you want. We got the hoodies. We got the uh, um, um, all the different kind of colored T-shirts. Um, and uh, make sure to include size, hashtag color. And, uh, yeah, I was going to get the uh, the website up and running for it, but that's probably not going to happen uh, Nice, Zoe. Hashtag coffee and cannabis. I like it. So, yeah, I think we're going to do uh, uh, um, I, the coffee on the dock shirts should be fine. I think it's going to be easy to render for Jimmy. Um, and we'll be doing goals and gratitude shirts as well. So, yeah, fuck it. Let's just start the next order now. Um, uh, Jillian, I think we're going to do all of them. So, you can do uh, um, whichever ones you want. And make sure to private message me because that, that's the only way I can keep a record of any of this. If you just say in the comments, I'm never going to remember just so that you know, um, just uh, private message me t-shirt order. I want this, this, and this, and I'll, uh, and I'll be able to write it all down from there. Okay. I'm telling you, everybody wants one of these hoodies. They are the shit. Um, so yeah. And if you want a copy mug, let me know that too. Cause I think that's, that's very, it's very likely that we should be able to get that done. Oh, hey, Fallon. John, private message me. I'll never remember, dude. And put yourself down for a coffee mug, too, because you're going to want one of those for sure. So, yeah. Um, We're also going to be working on a calendar. Paulina, if you're here, we need to talk about that quickly because I think we're going to need to get into production on that fast. Um, uh, so the shirts, uh, Janet, um, if you go to, uh, coffee on the dock page or the goals and gratitude page or the baboon room page, um, I've got all the, 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 um, the baboon room shirt styles are up there and the cost and, uh, price for those things is, is, is up there as well. If you just look through the pictures, um, the coffee on the dock and the goals and gratitude uh, uh, ones are just going to have, uh, um, the logo for goals and gratitude, uh, on whatever color shirt you want. Um, as well as, and, and the coffee on the dock one is just going to be the, the logo that just came out today. I showed it a little bit earlier. We haven't even, we haven't posted it anywhere cause he's not done it yet, but it'll still be all the same kinds of shirts, the same sizes, um, and probably around the same cost. Although the colors for the coffee on the dock one might make it but I'll, I'll put that basically like whatever you're, uh, whatever you're interested in let me know and then we'll be able to I'll be able to give you the sizes and different things like that and we'll, we'll figure all that stuff out
<clears throat> Katie Carter just messaged me because she's a genius. Stevie Lovell, how's it going, sister? Thank you for having the uh, um, the courage to have a really sort of really deep chat with me the other day. That was I, I know that was uh, was hard, but you kind of killed it. So super excited about that. Um, Daryl, so can I get Baboon Room on the front and Ohm Tribe on the back of a t-shirt? Um, yeah, probably. We'll figure that out. Uh, I'd love to do a run of those, actually. Yeah, just private message me that you want that, and I'll, I'll you know, I'll, I'll see what I can do to get those things squared away. Maybe what we can do, Daryl, maybe we can do a run together and get a few of them and then just give them to, uh, to Dino so he's got some to, to kick around. Stevie had a vision of a Babylon Room hoodie while driving. What was the hashtag on, uh, on, that, uh, on that hoodie? Yeah, I'm telling you, man, they're comfy and warm. And not just because, you know, I'm the one selling them. They're, like, legit really cool. It's just because Jimmy's awesome. All right. So, Dino, do you want to go, go in uh, um, half and half on those? I mean, my logo going in, I, I don't mind doing that. All right, Stevie, if there's any chance that you can come up to the, uh, um, we're doing a Goals and Gratitude meetup tomorrow at 6.30 at Gildog, I would love to sort of spend a little bit more one-on-one -on -one time and see sort of how things are, are, are falling into place in, uh, in your mind creeps. That'd be super cool. <sighs> Coffee is so good. Um, yeah, Eric saying, uh, she, Paulina is all over the quotes though. Love the one she made for Travis and Shannon. Totally, man. Like, um, I'm, I'm kind of thinking, I'm just gonna put this out there as far as the calendar thing is concerned. Um, and the, and the, and the 90 day book, um, yep. 6:30, Stevie, um, uh, that we're going to want to have a really strong idea, if not a completed uh, a digital copy of what we want to do by like Monday, maybe Tuesday. Like we need to get to work on this really quickly. Um, which means that I, I need to, uh, to hammer down the, uh, um, the dates for, uh, uh, I really want to put the dates in like making the goals and gratitude calendar uh, kind of part of the, the, uh, like the event vision that we kind of all created while we were out there for, for what's going on next year and the quarterly ones and stuff like that. I'd really love those integrated if we can. And we need 12, uh, 12 quotes. And we'll, uh, we, the idea you guys had as far as uh, uh, crowdsourcing the, uh, the best quotes, I think is a really good idea as well. For show. <laughs> John says, my coffee's in a can this morning. Hashtag fail. No. You drink whatever coffee you can get, man. Uh, can we talk about the animals left at the Ripley Aquarium because of the Tennessee fires? We need a bad moon room rescue mission. I don't even know what you're talking about. So I will read up on that and talk about it tomorrow. That's crazy. <laughs> Stevie, apparently you have to go. Even Paulina's coming. I might secretly put her on camera. Just kidding, Paulina, we're not doing that. We're just going to talk. So yeah, that's cool that you guys are coming. We can hash out all this, uh, all the stuff that we need to do uh, plan-wise and get that stuff, uh, get it rolling. Cool. Dino's going to be ordering some Ohm Tribe only shirts and would like to do some Bad One Room Ohm Tribe shirts as well. All right, cool. Yeah, let me let me uh, uh, collaborate on, on that because I would be willing to bet that there are a lot of uh, Gold and Gratitude people that would uh, would love that shirt. Um, for show. For show. That's nice out. Uh, sorry, Stevie was just uh, saying uh, I'll be taking lead in a drunk circle meeting at Gills. Yes, so I work. I, I uh, uh, set the meeting up so that we're gonna do like a group thing at six thirty for goals and gratitude. Awesome, Katie. That's really cool. Um, and uh, and then throughout the drum circle, I'm gonna be I think doing one on one stuff with people because um, I wanted to do that anyway. Um, so 
that's the other thing too. If you've uh, um, if you were at the uh, event this weekend, um, I'm gonna be either doing 15 minutes with everybody online with uh, with Zoom, which is just a, uh, like a teleconferencing uh, thing for computers, um, or we could meet uh, in person at Gills every other Wednesday at uh, at 7:30. Um, and I think that the Jedi's and I came up with uh, an accountability program that we're going to start for uh, goals and gratitude, as well as, and I, I'm not going to announce the details, but we're going to do like a friends of the farm uh, 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 sort of patron thing um, that people can do to uh, support the Great Spirit Farm, which uh, I'm pretty excited about as well. Oh, that's a really good idea. Um, Eric, can you private message me that, please? He said, can we get Jimmy uh, uh, to print us first annual Conscious Creator shirts with the vision for next year? 100% we're doing that. That's a really good idea. Um, actually, message that to me and Travis and, uh, and Shannon. Please. Good morning, Valerie. Charlotte, might show up tomorrow night. Please do. It would be really cool to see you, man. Gills is way kid-friendly. Like, way, 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 way... Gills is even dog friendly. Yeah, uh, and we're gonna be out in the uh, 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 the venue side, so it's like a park, and the, you know it's all fenced in, and you, they can run around, and it's it's awesome. Right, Stevie? Yes, you said yes to all of that. We just did. Um, yeah, that's that's such a great idea. We're gonna we're we're gonna do that, um, and only uh, only people that were there can buy them. I like it. Yeah, and we'll have like the intention for next year on it. Oh, I like it a lot. Oh, dude, shut up. You guys are too smart. <laughs> Jimmy, Jim, I think Jimmy figured out just not to come to Goals and Gratitude. And if he's here, he's just not saying anything. He's like, nope, enough work to do, you crazy weirdos. <laughs> That's awesome. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I don't know anything about that, but we should for sure try. <laughs> Robin, wow, wow, coffee, woohoo! Um, yeah, Dino, um, maybe message him that and CC Travis Jen because that is a redonkulously good idea. Um, yeah, I, I would buy two of those right now. I love you guys, man. <laughs> so, so this is what the goals and gratitude, for everybody who wasn't there, this is what it was like. Um, already we've got uh, um, education programs starting online and probably a workshop at uh, uh, the Great Spirit Farm for Kids. Uh, we got a goals and gratitude version for kids that's coming out pretty soon. We got a calendar that's coming out pretty soon. We got a, 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 a book so you can follow along with goals and gratitude started pretty soon. Um, just goals started to pop out everywhere and we barely got started. Like I wanted to spend way more time on goals, but we just ran out of time because it's the first time doing it. We just never tried it before. Uh, so Wednesday we're going to be working more on this stuff, but stuff for community engagement with, uh, you know, the homeless problem in, in, uh, in the County all just cause we got together and, and set the intention to do that. So, you know, if any of that sounds inspiring or fun, cause it was both of those things intently. Um, we're going to be doing another one in 90 days and you're going to want to come. It, it already feels like just something that, I mean, I'm just so proud, proud to have been a part of it. You know, like I, yeah, like I kicked the ball rolling, but so many people have picked it up and started running. It's really, really cool. Um, yeah, Charlotte, Jimmy going to be a busy guy. That's totally true. And we got to figure out how to make it worth his while to run all these crazy ideas. I'm going to talk to him about that. It's probably going to cost me a lot of money, but whatever it happens. Um, Eric has a seriously ridiculous goal and idea now. Okay. As long as that, uh, well, let me know if you could still do the blog thing. Cause if you don't have time, that's entirely fine, but it's, it's going to take at least an hour a day. Um, but, uh, yeah, I want it in writing, send it to me. And if you write it down on a piece of paper with a marker and take a picture of it and send it to me, you get extra points towards nothing. Uh, Dino, I'll bring a table and bench to drum circle so you have space for one-on-one -on -one and uh, such things. Thanks, Dino. You the best. Jillian, we totally need to get him an apprentice. We need to get Dino an apprentice, too. I want... What would it take to start an apprenticeship program? Hmm. 
Remind me to talk to Mears about that. Um, because uh, he's actually hooked up with like a, a really big one. Um, so there might be like a like sponsored, government sponsored fund and all that kind of stuff. So the, I don't know if, if that would work, but it might. I don't know. At least we can sort of use it as a model. That's interesting. Yeah, Eric, you know what? I'm going to... Uh, Oh man, it's gonna be a long night. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, because the computer's coming today at some point. So I'm gonna write blog posts for everything today, and I'm gonna track how long it takes me, and figure it out. Um, yeah, Daryl says bring your asses and excellent and play full on. Well, then come Wednesday. You know, I think that's that's you know if you can't make it for the goals and gratitude stuff, seven thirty and ten, or like the online thing, where's you out or whatever. Uh, just come and hang out with us. You'll see. You'll see what it's like. It's it's a thing. It's it's becoming just so much more amazing than I ever could have imagined. I literally did not imagine any of this, like at all. But it seems really obvious now, <laughs> which is super fun. Anyway, so Wednesday, six thirty, uh, right before the drum circle. So if you want to hang out for the drum circle, my wife is hanging out for the drum circle. That's weird. Um, she just wants to come and. and I guess she just zenned out something fierce. It was awesome. Didn't play anything, just, just wants to come and sit around the fire and, and, and chill. I'm super excited about that, to be honest. Um, so, uh, uh, Dino, could you private message me about the apprenticeship program? Again, I just want to keep all these ideas. You know what I mean? Like, if I don't write them down, I'm just going to have an idea, another idea in five seconds. I'm just going to forget about it. Um... Dino, I don't want to. I don't want to use, use the stage. Um, I want it to be very intimate. Like just even the corner. Uh, I was thinking the corner of the the minnow bar because I mean nobody, nobody's going to be at the minnow bar anyway. There's like chairs and we can hang out and there's like little spots for people to write stuff down. That's sort of what I'm thinking. Eric says I have notes for the Dr. Howland interview, so I'll shoot them to you. Uh, don't worry about that. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be posting stuff from today because that's that's you know we're I think. Depending on how we feel, Eric, we might start going back and, and uh, like, I might start going back and edit um, different episodes and, and post them. Um, we'll talk about that. I, I mean, there is a near infinite amount of work that we could do, so it just depends on, you know, like, if we want the blog to get, like, a million views or fucking hits in a year, we could do that. But it'll take, like, it'll take a lot of work. But, I mean, I'm up for it if you are. Daryl said Babs would love uh, festival then. Honestly, man, I would love to get her out to that, for real. She needs more of that kind of stuff in her life, 100%. Um, I'm excited about that idea, actually. Um, well, that uh, Eric, I agree, it gets us away from the volleyball players. I don't. Are there volleyball players on Wednesday nights? I didn't think there was. Um, Dude said so that's what I was thinking, too. As far as the stage, my... Uh, or the uh, the no thing. Uh, Steve says I need to figure out something with my disability access shower. Uh, we will be living in the house in about two weeks. Do you think you could talk to your friend? Yes, Steve. Thank you for reminding me. Could you private message me that as well? Um, just uh, uh, Corey, please talk to uh, Mears about and describe the problem in in uh, uh, um, detail in the message, and I will talk to him today. Also, thank you very much for reminding me about that. See, John. Awesome, John. I like it. Um, yeah, so we'll definitely, we'll, we'll post Dino's episode for sure. <laughs> um, Eric, I also was given a book about how to, uh, uh, to get a blog to, uh, over, uh, uh, over a million subscribers, um, uh, by one, uh, um, I can't even remember who it was, but it, they're awesome. Was it Melody Curtis? No, it was somebody else. Anyway, doesn't matter. Um, Maybe it was. Um, yep. Just hit a wall. Uh, so, yeah. Daryl, super excited to be talking, sitting down tomorrow. We're going to start uh, figuring out a schedule to get some uh, some music videos out of uh, Encore. I've been thinking about this, too, uh, Daryl. You know, you know, we'll be talking about, you know, contextual mentions and, you know, different things like that in, in the same vein as I do for, you know, Mirrors Plumbing or whoever else. 
Um, speaking of which, Stevie, thank you for uh, uh, letting me make a mirrors plumbing uh, uh, plug without even thinking about it. Um, but yeah, I think like regular music videos out of Encore with different local artists. Um, like I, they could come team up with me, right? Like I'll do some with Dino. I'll do some with Alex Centeno, who's like a total freaking you know murderer on the guitar and vocally. Um, but yeah, I mean, I'd be I'd be up for doing. Like if we even did like a little hour recording session, half an hour recording session every week, you know, and when it's a little bit slower, but it doesn't even have to be, you know, dead quiet or anything like that. Um, we just run in there, set up, play a couple songs, and then I'll add it up and uh, edit them and uh, uh, get them out there and uh, boost the crap out of them. I mean, Dino's, you know, uh, Dino's and my videos are over 40,000 views now. Those just went completely and totally redonkulously bonkers. So that's kind of fun. Uh, uh, uh. Stevie says, Babs is beautiful in so many ways. Grateful to find her meter. See, yeah, I mean, she's just the goods. There's no way around it. That is a fact. She's doing a 12-hour day today. If anyone is out and about, if you're out to boot, um, she works at the Walgreens now that's on 19 and Hudson. Um, so if you're driving by, I know she's like, this is her first 12-hour day, and she was sort of, kind of worried about it and you know not super excited about it if you're driving by the walgreens on hudson and 19 um if you stopped in to the pharmacy just to say hi to her and tell her she's awesome uh i will give you a giant hug in fact i would give you a giant hug anyway but just you know if you're driving by and you got 60 seconds to just walk in it would probably make her day um uh, anyway Steve Level, don't forget to send me pics and measurements of your swing area. Oh, cool. An arc Encore parking lot show. That's a good idea. I like that. Look at this. Um, Daryl, when you're saying, uh, hell yeah, no, there's a goal, could you tell me what you are referring to? Because I've talked about three things since I read that comment. Um, Eric's for sure going to be a drum circle. For show. Charlotte said, that's my Walgreens. Cool beans. Now you get to say uh, hi to Michelle whenever you want. Awesome. Times anyway. So this sort of turned it into a goals and gratitude workshop. But uh, So remember as well, uh, if, uh, if you're free Friday during the day, Hudson Elementary is doing um, the Great American Teach-In. Uh, and uh, stuff. Greg just said he's stopping by for some reason. What is going on over here? I don't have all the tripods. I only have two. Oh, whatever. It's cool. One sec here. Anyway. Sorry. <laughs> I'm actually getting tons of... Uh, yeah, recording an encore, right? I mean, it just, it just makes sense. And seriously, the, all the videos that I've done was just with this. I didn't even have mic set up. Um, although it might be interesting to test out, um, uh, like have some of the other tripods and have the mics out in front of people maybe or something like that. Cause these ones like the, as far as like little area spot mics. Um, but then if you, I mean, if you guys want to, there, there's an infinite number of things we can do. I just want to make it super simple, right? Before I was coming in, putting my, my, uh, just my, uh, my phone there and just recording, right? Relatively close, all acoustic, no setup time, no nothing. You come in, record a couple songs, and then I, you know, can come home and, uh, and edit them all up and, and, uh, um, and have them out. Like it's, it's, it's fast. So we can create that content and get it, get it out there. Um, and, you know, tagged with, uh, you know, encore music and, you know, whatever it, it just, the simpler we can make it, the better. Right. Um, but yeah, let's, uh, so we'll, we'll talk about that tomorrow and we'll book the first time and Dino and I, uh, will uh, will come in and, uh, um, do the inaugural one and I'll book the next one with Alex and then whoever else you want, like who, who, who do you want to showcase an encore that is like a really good, uh, you know, client or customer or whatever. And then we'll, uh, we'll do that thing. Do that thing. Stevie says, I'll have to have that info. And my son was telling him about it and he was pretty excited as well. Yay. See you there. Cool beans. Dino, you know, did you just throw the Facebook page for Encore Music on there? Um, what uh, what's the number of likes for Encore Music anyway? What's our what's our benchmark? What are we trying to what are we trying to get past? Uh, milestone wise, if somebody could tell me how many likes they have, that'd be fantastic. While you're there, like it, share it. Hmm. 
there's going to be an another, another, a tother. <clears throat> I can English good. Another pot of coffee in my future. For show. Hey, Marcus. What's going on, man? <laughs> Eric, I totally want to try your, uh, uh, your Bondo board. Is that what that thing was called? I think I will be very bad at it, but I think it would be really, really good for me. See, so he has this like, weird bounce ball board thing. 3,000. Okay, when... Let's maybe... That's a really... So... We probably need some time for that. Um, but definitely, for sure. Let's do 2,500 before, before uh, uh, New Year's. No, 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 no. Maybe we could just get them. That's interesting. I like big goals. And I cannot lie. Okay. Yeah, Dino, let's brainstorm this. Because I think with the music videos and the way that we're going to do that, as long as I make sure that... Because I was going to do this anyway. Their Facebook page is in there, and we can just use that as our, as our call so that Encore Music gets like that capture, right? Um, and my budget for, uh, for promoting those music videos is relatively consistent. And we can cross-post them... Uh, we could cross post them with the uh, um, the Encore music page, um, and they can boost them if they want as well. Interesting, like button. Mm. Indo board. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're very interesting. I like that a lot. It's funny, man. Some people are people. Are, you know, coffee. It's not like your traditional coffee on the dock, right? But this is what that event started. Like, there's what been. 20 freaking uh, uh, killer ideas just on this thread alone, right? Yeah, this is the ball that we got rolling, guys. This is what's going to start happening. We got to get really good at writing stuff down. We got to get really good at, at, at following through, right? But all this, uh, all this sort of, you know, uh, conscious creation is the thing. Is the thing. So, yeah, 3,000. I'm thinking, like... It's possible to do it by New Year's, but I'm pretty sure we could get it done by the end of January. <laughs> Hashtag, I like big goals and I cannot lie. Yeah, there, there's a t-shirt there too for goals of gratitude, hey? <laughs> I like it. Right, they would just manifest that stuff out of thin air. Sorry, Eric just said, what would Shannon and Travis do, Corey? Set a big goal and just do it. Yep. And remember Rex Rogers is the store manager? I would, but I have no idea who that is. I'm sure Rex Rogers is awesome. Morning, Chris. What's going on, buddy? Um, Chris, do you, you've got a page for your, uh, for your jewelry and stuff, right? You should throw that up there. Quinn, what's going on, buddy? I just noticed you around here. What's going on? And uh, Chris, maybe next week or uh, whenever it's convenient, we'll uh, have you up for coffee on the dock. And I'd love to pick your brain for the whole online marketing thing because I am legit making this shit up. <clears throat> Man, I'm going to have to review the comments just to see how many unbelievably killer ideas we had. It was more than, more than once. Um, I'm going to have to check my calendar, but maybe even uh, Thursday if you're free. And if you want, depending on how early you can get up here, um, like I'm having, uh, uh, Derek from Live Fit plug, uh, speaking of which everybody in here who has like a health goal at all, if you're not coming to boot camp with me, I hope that you live like an hour and a half away. Otherwise you should come to boot camp with me. Um, so yeah, Derek's coming all morning. He's going to do 730 goals and gratitude. He's going to do, uh, 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 coffee on the dock with me. It's going to be good. So if you'd like, you can come for the whole thing and we can, you know, do all three uh, sessions together and, and just hang out all morning, which would be super cool. Yeah, man, I could use all the help with that that I can possibly get. Awesome. So guys, if you can go uh, uh, to that page as well, a uh, lot of awesome Christmas uh, Christmas ideas uh, from uh, from Chris. He makes you know um, really really amazing pieces, and it's and it's his passion. We talked about it this weekend, um, and it's really really fun to to uh, to watch him do that. You know, like he had like a regular sort of day job, you know, for a long time, and now, like Jimmy, man, he's like he's getting out 
and Dino and everybody else, frankly. He's getting out and doing what he actually wants to do, the stuff that, uh, that makes, him, uh, makes him super passionate. Anyway, um, somebody's here, and it might be my computer, so I need to go.